The battleship New Jersey, a symbol of power and strength, was a fitting backdrop to promote another show of force, the Penn Mutual Collegiate Rugby Championships, to be held the weekend of June 3rd and 4th at Talon Energy Stadium outside of Philadelphia, which can be seen on the networks of NBC. Students from the Governor Mifflin School were on hand for Rugby 101, learning about the fastest growing sport in America, Rugby Sevens. The students took part in demonstrations as men's teams from Navy and St. Joseph's and women's squads from Bloomsburg and Temple were led by David New, the president of Super Sevens Rugby. When we talk about air, we also talk about space, passing the ball into space, a little bit like basketball again, right? Pass the ball, he gets into space, I move again, comes back to me, and we work our way up the field. What is the major skill that has to be learned? A lot of people know how to swing a bat or throw a ball, but what's the major skill for this sport? Uh, well, I mean, passing is a big thing, but honestly, at the end of the day, it's, it comes down to just being an athlete. I mean, our team is just a bunch of new guys, so that all they know how to do is run and run hard. So I think we do pretty well for what we know, and I think anybody can pick up the sport really quickly. Rugby Sevens resonates with both men and women as a sport that promotes both teamwork and individualism. With rugby, you're very dynamic and you have almost opportunities to complete different um, plays, different drills, and you even have a sense of your own uniqueness in it. You also get to have your own little spark and your own little unique sense of your team on the field with you. like having fun and like showing different plays that you guys created or just something that shows who you are and it gets transferred in your skills and in your play on the sport and on the field. Well, sevens is a lot of discipline. The conditioning and the drills that we do takes a lot of discipline and drive and will. So I think that that kind of prepared me for the working world because I don't really want to be an adult <laughs> but like you got to do it so just like you got to you know do your drills and condition and work hard so you can be better for your team. So if you want to be better for yourself, you got to work hard. I've played sports my whole life and there's no bond like the bond I've had playing rugby. So, I mean, when you go up on a field and you practice and you're beating, beating each other up really at practice, then you come off the field and you're best friends, whether it's your own teammate or you're playing a game or something. It's just, it's like nothing else. Several years ago, Penn Mutual and United World Sports saw the potential behind this fast-paced game. Well, seven years ago when this first came about, uh, the Olympics announced that Rugby Sevens were going to be part of the 2016 Olympic Games. We were invested in Rugby Sevens through the USA Sevens and we were the leaders in the sport. And we decided that the college rugby teams deserved the Sevens National Championship. So we partnered with NBC, created this tournament, brought it to the wonderful city of Philadelphia, uh, and it's grown ever since. Several news outlets were on hand to find out what Rugby Sevens is all about. It's seven players on seven on a field the size of a soccer field, 100 metres by 70, uh, seven minute halves, two seven minute halves, so there's a lot of play where the ball's put in space, player will pass and get into space and get the ball back, so there's a lot of action, a lot of activity, and something that basketball fans in America will be familiar with. The contact, not so, but in terms of ball movement, ball handling, absolutely like basketball. Is that the big thing that's going to help the sport grow, the fact that almost everybody gets a chance to touch the ball? Yeah, I think that's something that's really unique about the sport. There's no like blocking positions or someone that doesn't really get the ball. Everyone gets to touch the ball, everyone has responsibility, and everyone gets an opportunity to score, which is the ultimate goal. It's awareness um, and participation. So we try to get as many people out to the stadium because if they like football, if you like basketball, if you like soccer, you're going to love Rugby Sevens. It's fast-paced, high-energy excitement, and non-stop action. It's perfect for today's millennials, and it's perfect for uh, the nature of where media is trending. The networks of NBC Sports will be on hand at Talon Energy Stadium as they host the Penn Mutual Collegiate Rugby Championships for a seventh consecutive season on June 3rd and 4th. Ticket information is available at usa7scrc.com.